Today we're going to take a quick look at slum values because there's been some major changes. Hey guys, finally he sleeps here back with another market video. Again, we're going to talk about slum value because there's been um, a slow build in slum value this season. Uh, if we look back at the numbers where we were at the beginning of the year and not the beginning of the season, but the beginning of 2024, and the, everything was a slight build. So from like 80 to 92 in that range, which is where we were investing and buying it went from 70,000 at 80 to 100,000 at 81 to 115,000 at 82, 130,000 at 83. As you can see, it's like there is a build. But what we've seen now is with the values on these players, there are multiple OVRs, giant ranges of OVR in that 80 to 95 range where the slum value doesn't change. And there's, a, I think what the gradual progression is, is there's no reset coming. Things are not going to change this season. At the, in the fall, it's not going to reset everybody's OVR. There's, it's not going to change to a new game. This is what we're stuck with. And it's going to continue to slow roll and slow build. So what they've done is slowly started to drop off lower OVRs and make them less important. We're not seeing its changes in the lower values. We're, we're starting to see that 80 to 84 range as being defunct cards. They're kind of walking away from it. Now, that doesn't mean that they won't have value down the road if some weird exchange comes back or something. But what we're seeing right now is a complete shift in value on the low end of 80s. And that's not just it. There's other areas where the shift has happened as well. So if we go back, let's do a search here for 84s. We'll just look at my players because I have a lot of in this range of 80 to 85. So we look at 84s right now on the low end for older cards. We have a value here. Let's see, 90.1. So 90,000 is where we have these on the low side of existing 84s. Right now, you can get them as cheap as 87,000. That is their current listed slum value. That's where it maxes out and kind of pegs in at the market, 87,000. If you go back to the beginning of the year, uh, back in January and February, slum value for 84s was 214,000. So any of those long-term investments bought back then for this value, those shifts, have kind of fallen aside to the where we're we're paying attention to the programs and not the player value. So we didn't see a big shift where it was like, oh my God, all of a sudden all these players aren't worth anything. It's just that it slowly, gradually has started to shift with values where the exchanges and different things that have happened in the game have pushed the numbers higher and then pushed the numbers lower. And where the slum value sits, it's kind of dropped back and we don't have a lot of these 999 transactions because there's enough players in the market right now. And because it is a global market, we don't see that happening. Uh, once you go higher uh, to 85, right now they're 88 to 100,000. You can get 85s as low as 90,000 in the market. Pretty simply here. Here we go. Look, uh, And it's, yeah, 89.1 purchase value on an 85, where back in February, 85s dropped out their slum value at plus 999 transactions uh, was at 309,000. That is a massive change. So 309,000 dropped down to 89,000. Uh, but where the old system went from 85s at 309 up to 86s at 650, we're now at 425 for 86s. We're also at 425 for 87s. 86s and 87s in this current market have the same slum value. And that's just weird. We've never seen that before where multiple OVRs have the same slum value. 88 right now is at 795 where it used to be over a million. 
Uh, 89s are also at 795, where they used to be 1.4 million. So we now have everything in the 80s below 800,000. As we're seeing all these numbers slowly start to drop, it is just as likely that we could see those numbers go down because right now we have a jump from 85 to 86 at 88,000 to 425,000. That is a big jump. And I, I'm, it makes me nervous that the 86s and 87s, 88 and 89s could drop in value to fill that gap. And then if that happens, we're gonna see everything else come down. Now, what we haven't seen is a shift in value at 90 and above. These actually are kind of sitting, well, actually right now the numbers are way up. That's another point of this video. 90s, uh, two weeks ago, were at 1.59. Uh, I think I had a video um, a couple of weeks ago, one of the weekly videos where we just started investing in 90s. Over, this, see how they've plummeted. Where there's no need for any of these players anymore. But those may see a slight bump. I don't know, there's just a lot. I'll probably spend some money on them as well, though. I think just because I'm out, I have no 90s. And I, I spent about 200 million on 90s, which is where these are coming in. So 1.59 mil uh, spent. So if we claim this, we're looking at, well, we're just about 600,000 coins profit for every uh, 90 that's been sold here. So we're, we're coming in, it's pretty big numbers if you did invest in 90s a couple of weeks ago when they were at 1.59. Uh, we're right now at 90s, 1.59, but they were four months ago, 2.12. So again, we're seeing that drop and shift. 91s were at 3.9. They are now at 3.3. 92s were at 5.77. They are now at 4.75. Uh, we have exchanges. There's different shifts as players get added in that make these changes as well, but it's just slum value is not set in stone. It can shift over time. We know that we need to be prepared for it. Uh, and if you're paying attention, the values are starting to shift and we're seeing not only exchanges, but different things that are being added to the game that are giving added value. So like right now, if you're paying attention, the nineties are up. Uh, they're up because of a couple of different factors. We have the Mascherano exchange that's right now that is shifting values. And once that kind of cycles out, it could drop back down. We have uh, the, um, what is it, the extra time that people have been investing in still. I don't understand why, but uh, there's shift in those values. 91's at 3.32, not necessarily an investment that I would go after. But right now, 90's and... The 92s are the two OVRs that if you're going to invest in anything, when they hit their slum value, those are the two that I would look after, 90s and 92s. But 90s, when they do drop back down to that 1.59 range, buy at will. That's it. I'm finally he sleeps. Hope that helps. Uh, as long as it did, make sure you subscribe here at YouTube. Turn on notifications so you never miss when a video goes live. Uh, it does make a big difference here on the channel. I uh, hope that information helped. Make sure you check out my other channels as well. Raid Shadow Legends, my main presence here on YouTube, which is uh, the Gearheads channel for all things cars. And then if you're looking for a few laughs, check out Cringeworthy.